Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. In this lesson, we'll be analyzing the sixth chapter of the first part of the novel Atonement by Ian McKinney. This happens to be uh, a quite brief and concise chapter. So let us go on with it quickly. So after eating lunch and ensuring that the children will behave, Emily Tellis who is the mother of Bryony and Cecilia Terrace, she retreats to her bedroom. And she's tormented by a weight, a weight that sits on her brain like an indifferent animal. She thinks about Leon's carefree life as a banker and Cecilia's carefree life as well as a college student. But then she begins to worry about Bryony, whom she believes is being mistreated by Lola. Lola is a free spirited woman, girl, and this free spiritedness reminds Emily of her much resented sister, Hermione, who is actually Lola's mother. So, with yet another shift in perspective, the relationships between the characters are complicated still further. Even fully grown Emily is not above the petty judgments and grudges that her younger relatives also feel. The themes again happen to be perspective and class because class has a huge role in defining or shifting or baking the perspectives of the people. Okay, then later on Emily dozes off. And when she wakes up, she continues to think about Bryony's uneasiness and talent as well. She reflects grumpily on Hermione's pleasure-seeking abandonment, abandonment of her children. And she vows that she will only take care of Jackson and Pirrit because that is her duty. And she's only doing this out of duty. Otherwise, her, their mother, Hermione, has not done a good act by abandoning them. So Emily continues to plan the rest of her errands, committed to maintaining control over the day. And this happens to be an addition uh, of a character who happens to think that he or she can control the surrounding. So every detail and atonement it can be interpreted differently depending on the perspective from which it is viewed. To Emily, her youngest daughter's bossiness is a mark of talent. Yani ke Bryony's bossiness is a mark of talent. Rather than a character flaw because to the audience, to the other characters, it is seen as a flaw in the character. And on the other hand, she sees her sister's children as mere burdens because of her resentment toward their mother. So the children have nothing to do with it. She feels them to be a burden because she resents their mother. Okay, so the themes would be perspective, class, and stories and literature. Because Bryony's perspective of looking at things and controlling and trying to control things, it, it happens to be portrayed in her way of writing. Okay, so with this, we're going to end this chapter. If you've got any questions, please feel free to ask.